The Kashmir Files director Vivek Agnihotri had recently tweeted an unsigned letter claiming that it was issued by Pakistan's banned terror group Lashkar-e-Islam. The letter threatened to kill kafirs, non-believers in Kashmir. It also threatened Kashmiri pundits. Agnihotri's tweet received close to 10,000 retweets. Based on his tweet, media outlets Newsroom Post, News 18, Amar Ujala, and Lokmat News ran stories claiming that Lashkar-e-Islam threatened Kashmiri pundits to leave Kashmir. Pro BJP propaganda outlet Op India, while reporting on the killing of Satish Kumar Singh, a civilian in Kulgam, also claimed that the letter was issued by Lashkar-e-Islam. But what is the truth? All news found that one Vijay Raina tweeted the same letter a few hours before Vivek Agnihotri. Raina claimed that the letter was found in Virvan Pandit Colony in Baramulla and that it was sent by post. Raina's tweet was the earliest tweet we found carrying the letter. We spoke with Vijay Raina, who is a sarpanch of Kulgam. He told us that he is in touch with Kashmiri pundits living in settlements in Kashmir under PM package jobs. Raina informed that he received the letter from a resident of Virvan Colony in Baramulla district. He also added that as per his knowledge the letter was delivered by a postman. A report by Times Now carried similar information. It said the letter was delivered via post to the security detail of the colony on the evening of April 12th. Times Now also said that the letter doesn't seem to be real according to the police given the fact that the said terrorist organization's existence is uncertain. Apart from the police statement there are also several red flags that raise doubts about the authenticity of the letter for instance it is not signed Lashkar-e-Islam is misspelled as Lashkar with an e a similar letter to the one viral was also shared in 2016 this letter also threatened kashmiri pundits or news found that the 2016 letter also had red flags like the misspelling of Lashkar-e-Islam. Hindustan Times reported that the 2016 letter surfaced near the transit accommodation for government employees in South Kashmir. While the police confirmed the presence of the poster, Pulwama SP Rais Mohammad Bhatt had said, "We believe it is a work of miscreants who want to create fear among the minority community." Both the letters, the 2016 one and the one currently viral, carry the logo of Jamaat-ud-Dawa, which is a different terror group. In fact, The logo on the letters itself reads Jamaat ud Dawa Pakistan. Pakistani journalist Zarar Khurro shared with Alt News a genuine letter issued by Lashkar-e-Islam where the symbol of the terror group is completely different. It is a black flag. The recently viral letter also makes references to civilian killings in Kashmir to portray Lashkar-e-Islam to be behind the killings. However, the resistance front had taken responsibility for these attacks. The letter is just dubious. but news outlets ran stories on the letter based on a mere tweet by Vivek Agnihotri